student hostels developer Acorn Holdings has launched a 700-bed accommodation complex for students of the United States International University, Africa. According to the CEO, Edward Kirade, despite the slowdown due to the pandemic, investments in student accommodation has rebounded as schools reopen. Acorn currently manages the Kwetu Babandogo, Kwetu Jogo, and Parklands properties and has plans to float fresh bids for the remaining 738 million shillings unsubscribed bond offering that will take place later in the year. Now, earlier this month, Acorn's green bond was oversubscribed by 1 billion Kenya shillings. The buildings like this you've seen today, they are extremely capital intensive. This particular place you are today, this is of a billion shillings to build and equip. Now, with that kind of capital outlay, it is very difficult for universities to do this by themselves. It would mean that they move away from their core business of academic and research to start doing student, which is non-core. By partnering with Econ Holdings, USIU Africa may re uh, consider redeploying the resources that it would invest in constructing student accommodation to other academic-related programs, such as ICT infrastructure projects due to the evolving instruction format to online learning being accelerated by the COVID-19 pandemic.